Kenjido Training Center provides a week-long course of instruction in rappelling. During the first couple of days, the students are introduced to the basics of knot tying, building rope bridges, rock climbing, and rappelling. These preliminaries and the first times up on the rocks are extremely important because they teach the students the correct methods of performing various tasks which keep them from getting hurt in the tougher portions of training. They're simply going to go ahead and leave and walk at your ankles. Let the rope glide through your hand. Break. Halfway down, he's going to have you break. You notice his break position. On the second day, students are introduced to the balance climb. Combining strength and agility, the students negotiate the rock face, moving to the top where they begin their first rappel. It's an 85-foot rock face just about straight down. Even though the rock's imposing, after a couple of tries and a couple of bruises, they're ready to move on. The next phase puts the students atop a 110-foot drop to the beach below. Once the students have mastered all the knots, rope bridges, and rappelling techniques, they all get psyched up for the finale of the course, the Chejido Challenge. Here, students are tested on all the techniques they've learned over the previous days. Reporting from the Chejido Training Center, I'm Army Sergeant Lee Travis, AFKN News.